Alright John, so I'm with the car now. Uh, I've already done like the entire inspection but I'll go back in detail a little bit with the with the car uh, on video. So basically the car is actually pretty nice. Uh, I think that there's not that much, it's been polished quite a few times so the coating doesn't seem very thick or anything, especially on the plastic but it's kind of to be expected uh, for a car this age, especially if it's parked outside. But there's no peeling of the coating so the paint is pretty nice. The worst that I could find was just on that van that would need to be repainted, but nothing much really. Uh, the car doesn't seem to have any accident history. Uh, there's like every so like the battery was dead, so the engine is still running. Sorry about that if it's a bit noisy, but uh, no, no accident history that I could figure out. Uh, just inspecting it like that, all the like all the panels seems new, that like, seems original to the car, and then like nothing there was replaced or anything like that. Uh, I checked under also, like there's absolutely no rust anywhere. Uh, clearly the car hasn't moved for a while, as you can see with the condition of the brakes. Uh, yeah, like it really wasn't used a lot, like for, for quite a while. I'm not sure how long it's been parked here. But uh, yeah, not, not exactly like a car that was used recently at all. Uh, in the trunk, absolutely no rust whatsoever. Like super clean. in there with the speakers but uh, well nothing too bad really uh, I'm not sure if the exhaust is original to the car is there like some sort of a name on them I'm not sure no, it's really really drawn in there but as you can see under there like uh, no bend proximity of the exhaust. Uh, seats like do look like the kind of seats that have been used only like 95,000 kilometer. I think that was the mileage of the car. I have to check again. 96,382 kilometer. As you can see foam is still very nice. Like really no issues whatsoever. Uh, gear knob, I don't know if it's been replaced, but uh, doesn't show like uh, use or abuse or anything, so it really looks like uh, the part for a car that's only 96,000 km. Very clean and nice. Uh, yeah, conditioning, I can turn it down a little bit and see if the AC turns on. The compressor just kicked in. And the AC works. Yep, AC works. So let me turn it off. It's noisy enough as it is with the car being on. Uh, rear seat, similar condition, really never been used much, I guess. Just overall, overall, really nice. Uh, yeah, what else? So let's get in the driver's seat. Up. So, power steering. Feels normal. Does feel fine. The clutch is grabby. So yeah, it does seem like a pretty good car. We definitely need some gas. <laughs> But uh, other than that, it is actually pretty nice. So I, I will let it warm up a little bit, just check for any like uh, bubbling in the in the coolant line or anything. It is signed here. I'm not sure who signed it. I just noticed that actually. So it doesn't smell like cigarette or anything like that. Uh, the roof liner is nice. Uh, but uh, yeah, maybe I will ask if you guys can figure out who signed it. Maybe it's Tommy McKinnon. Who knows? <laughs> Uh, yeah, that's it. I'm gonna see if there is some water in there, if the water jet thing works. I guess there's probably no water on the on the intercooler sprayer. But uh, yeah, it's on tin color also, which is a nice addition on those cars. Uh, probably doesn't help because they're not exactly super comfortable to begin with, but uh, it does help. For anything else other than comfort yeah no that's overall like a pretty nice car uh, also as 
I said, like the plastic, I mean, it's a red car. That's a, that's the main thing with red cars also. Like the, the plastic does tend to fade a little bit. So I can go back a little bit on the... So this side is actually not too bad. The bumper, I'm wondering if the bumpers have been repainted. They do seem a bit too nice for a red car. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if they peeled at some point. If you look at the difference, for example, here, like there's clearly a paint difference, so the bumper has surely been replaced. Uh, like this and this are definitely two different tones of red. So my guess would be that the plastic has been... Uh, either the plastic faded and they decided to repaint the bumper, or maybe some very minor impact uh, on, the, um, on the rear bumper and they decided to replace it. Uh, but again, like, I really cannot see any bent thing anywhere. So if there is an accident history, it's for sure very, very minor. And again, it could just be because of the, well, the red car being a red car and uh, becoming pink over time uh, or, uh, with the plastics and stuff. But uh, yeah, need a little bit of polishing here. Clearly needs a bit of a, of a cleanup, though they did try. So they do get a point for trying. <laughs> but uh, no, it's a nice car. It's, uh, it's, it's definitely, definitely a good car. They went cheap with the tires, but uh, well, can't blame, can't blame them. Tires are pretty new though, so that's that's a good thing. Up. Uh, yeah, can go back on the engine bay a little bit. Yeah, there's no leak or anything like that also. So the car was parked here, so I could easily check if there was any leak or anything. It, it moved it, so... Uh, and absolutely no problem whatsoever. Uh, when I'll turn off, I will check for any... Ah, oh, shit, there's a bolt on there. Eh. Uh, but uh, yeah, next step is going to be checking for uh, any bubbling in the... And it does go back to idle, idling perfectly. So yeah, no, overall a pretty damn nice car really. Definitely, definitely a nice car. Only thing, as I said, just the bumper. Like, uh, bumper most likely being repainted. Rear bumper, but uh, that's uh, that's about it, really. Also, another thing here, I like no rust issues around the wing. Just a little dirty. You can see here, it goes through. Now, it's a, it's, a, it's a very nice car. Does it come with uh, like a little toolkit coming with it? Come on, toolkit, toolkit. Maybe under there. I missed it. Yeah, it's here. Toolkit comes with the car. Right? I guess that's pretty much it. Uh, yeah, overall, very nice car. Um, I don't know why you're getting it, but uh, you should get it. <laughs> it is pretty nice. Alright. Cheers, guys.